Today I'm going to present a simple simulation of an open flow switch using the FlowSim simulator. FlowSim is a web browser simulator of a SDN switch. It does not simulate network topologies, instead it emulates the internal process of a SDN switch as match flow tables entries and uh, apply instructions. We will make this test based on the article. Performance evaluation of uh, open flow controllers for network virtualization. First, let's just make some brief comments about the paper. Uh, the paper aims to investigate open flow performance in a virtualized test bed. They use the open source virtualized controllers like Chimer for the Light and Nox. The purpose of this research was to analyze how the lane impacts ICMP, TCP, and DP traffic. Uh, a software switch, they used the OpenV switch and Mininet as emulation platform. And this is the topology of the experiment. They have done measurements of TCP and DP traffic between test TX and test RX and ECMP traffic between test TX and the hosts is H1, H2, H3 and uh, H4. They produce two uh, background traffic between HA hosts uh, and HB hosts passing through the switch S2. Mm, this is the part of the paper where the experiment is described. And what to I'm going to do uh, now? I'm I'm going to use in flow sim to simulate S2 switch traffic. First, I have gave IP addresses and MAC addresses to all the hosts that I need to use in the simulation. Then I created the packets that I want to simulate. I've created two IMCP packets. As explained in the paper, the IMCP traffic was made using ping requests, so I had to configure the package with type H and code 0. I created two, two background traffic packets using two pairs of H, A, and HB hosts available as sources and destination. So the background traffic will be made from HA85 to HB123 and HA22 to HB155. Finally, create two one TCP and one UDP packet. Here are the packets that I had created in the flow sim simulator. It's a example of a packet. And here's the bridge trace that I had to create to the packet traffic. So here's the flow sim simulator, and here's the switch that I had created for this simulation. As we may see, there was 10 tables available, but I used just two of them. So I programmed these flows. The first table that, that the package will match is the table 0. If the package comes from port 2, it is immediately forward to port 3. Otherwise, if the package has IP address that belongs to this subnetwork, it is sent to the second table, the table 1. And then a uh, longest prefix match operation is, is executed to decide to which port the package must be forward. For example, this and this port. So let's begin the simulation. The first IMCP package. 
MAC address, IP address, type in code. Matching table zero. Instruction go to matching table one. Instructor output part five as expected. The first background background package. Matching table zero. It will be directly forward to the port three. The second ISMP package. As expected the second ISP package will be forward to port 4 port 4 The second background traffic package. Direct forward to the port tree. GCP package. As expect to be forged to the port four. The UDP package. Port four. So we ended the simulation. Some reference. That's all, folks. Our link with the presentation PDF will be available in the video description. Thanks for watching.